So today I'll be talking about how to use an Android support library. It can come in the form of JAR or AR. These are the zip form of libraries in, in Java to be specific in Android. So if you don't have these two, if you don't have these two here, you can get it on Sketchly. The link will be in the description. So, for instance, you saw on GitHub, you saw a library you need, and it's in Android X. Sorry, it's in Android support library. So, you need not to worry, you can apply it in Sketchware. Thanks to Argus for his tool he provided. So, all you just need to do is if you, you download it using Sketchware library downloader, what you should do is to come here. You should come here. You come here, you come to your sketch where you come to libs, local underscore libs. For instance, this is an Android support library I downloaded. So the first thing you you click on the jar, you don't click on the classes.dex, you click on the jar. So you select the output parts. Automatically it selects here, so no much work. So you click on my read. Mind you, you only check this box only if you want to convert it to from Android X to Android support. So if you are not converting it, you need not to do anything here. So you migrate it. So it's migrating all the areas in the in the jar, all the classes that has anything Android support, it's migrating it to Android X classes. So that way you can use the library. So when you have migrated it, you come to the library that was migrated. So you come to the library, you delete the previous library. You delete the previous library. You change the name to classes.jar. You change the name to classes.jar. Then you delete the dex. So using almost to using almost to you locate you locate the library that you have migrated we are going to manually convert it to dex okay let me be sure because in notation 26 so We are converting the J, the dex. Okay, so it has been converted to dex from J to dex. So that is all. That is all you should do. Then you can go back to your sketchware and select it. You can go back to your sketchware. You can go back to your sketchware. Can go back to and select it. So that is all. That is how to use an Android support library in Sketchware. Or if your source code is is the Android Android, your source code is an Android support source code, and converting it to Android X is going to stressful for you, and you want to use an Android X library. So you can also do the same. All you just need to do is enable this checkbox. You enable the checkbox. So instead of migrating it to Android X, what it does is it reverses Android X to Android support. So please remember to subscribe. If this video helped you, subscribe. And for those who haven't downloaded Sketchly, you are missing out on the great things of being a developer because I upload exciting source code here, which I think you might find interesting. Thank you.